All right. <laughs> Attempt number 596 on a live stream. Wow. <laughs> it's a first. That's a very first. But anyways, what up, randomies? This is your boy, Gizmo GX, and welcome to our sixth session of Scarlet Nexus. And your boy is a little bit confused with the stream labs because I got followed by a bot and I had to resolve that. That's why, because that's why I was like a little bit like, how do you say it? Stalling out. So anyways, I've been here for like 10 minutes. So, uh, yeah. So let's get on with this episode. Anyways, uh, last time we left off, we were doing some story mode stuff. Well, not story mode stuff. We were doing a couple bonus episodes. And one of the things that we actually did was try to do this Kasane arc. This Kasane arc. And guess what? It didn't work out. It didn't work out. We got blocked and no more communication. You see that no subject, no Kasane. I mean, that's, that's as far as our DMs go. And that's it. We had a group chat with uh, Sugami, Luca, Travers, Gamma, everyone else. Because we just witnessed this hospital that is changing these other people. And doing some MK Ultra stuff like mind control and all that. And so, yeah, that's pretty much it. I think that's where we left off. And now we might as well do this Kagura Dono stuff. So, anyways. Uh, hey, stop by Masubis. We're not allies now, but I want to talk about Sugami. Don't ignore this. It's important. It better be important. It, you know, you're talking Sugami here. So let's do this Bond episode about Sugami. I don't know what it's about, but I feel like I should hear it. Okay, I'll see you at Masubis. Oh, we're not exactly allies right now, but let's not worry about that when we talk. There are things I wonder about, but if we do that, we won't be able to talk it out. So I won't bring it up. Hey, my boy is doing some plays. That, that's all right. Oh, there you are. I was beginning to think you wouldn't come. I hate killing time by myself. So you said you wanted to talk about Sugumi. Did something happen with her? Hmm. Oh, nothing like that. I'm just a bit concerned. I mean, that girl is kind of difficult for most people. Eh. What do you mean, difficult? We have connections. She doesn't talk a lot, unlike me. And it takes her time to warm up to other people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she is pretty quiet. We did. We have noticed that a lot in the series. Long time, and we get along just fine. I just worry whether she's getting along with everyone else. And now she's away from me in a new team, so I'm losing sleep worrying that she might be getting left out. Oh, don't worry, we she ain't getting left out. That. I'm sure she's getting along fine with everyone. Oh, well, if Mr. Straight as an Arrow Yuito says it, I guess I can trust you. I kind of get the sense that he's making fun of me. She's hmm. not like me. She's a good girl. So you take care of her. I'm counting on you, seriously. Oh, don't worry. I'll, I'll do my best. You can count on me. I'll do my oh, best. That was kind of unexpected. I never saw him at the type to worry about other people. Sure, he's a joker, but he's actually pretty kind. Thank you. That being said, wait, I, I said thank you to myself. Ask him about it. <laughs> yeah, I think that might be best. Hey, Kagro. I have something I want to ask you. Is that okay? It's about my father, actually. Hmm? Yeah, what do you want to know? Well, you see, the world thinks Kasane killed him, and I saw Kasane holding a knife, but I still can't get myself to come to terms with it. Do you know what actually happened? Oh. Sorry, but I can't say anything. Maybe I will someday, but not now. Brother, what? Please, he was my father. Well then, let's say Kasane did do it. I'm sure she would have had a good, valid reason for doing so. Fine, Another bot, but God I want dang. to know that reason. And then what? What are you gonna do? It's not something you can forgive just because you know why. Well, yeah, but... Let's just forget all that for now. Why don't we talk about something nicer? Something nicer? He's just trying to change the subject. But I know he knows something. Anyway, let me be straight. Are there any girls in the OSF you like? Anyone that you've had your eye on? Oh, Kagero! What? Where did that come Where from? Where did that come from? You caught me off guard. Don't be shy. Tell old Kagero how you really feel. Nah, Your bro. childhood friend Hanabi or the cool Kasane. Are you all about a cute face? Or could it be the magnanimous Kyoka? Huh? No, I mean, I never... Um, I guess I never really thought about it. 
Okay, hold up. So you're serious? You're not just being shy? Life can be really boring without a little desire, kid. What about you? You did seem pretty interested in Sugumi. Oh, don't I can gonna... it. I don't think of Sugumi like that. Damn, we caught you off guard. She and I are best friends. We understand each other. What we have is a connection of the souls. It's deeper than just a man and a woman. Oh. So you're almost like family. I understand that kind of thing better than talking about what my type is. <laughs> you God really damn. are lame and boring. If you don't loosen up, you might just end up suffocating yourself. God well, damn. I've never really had any problems before. All right, I got it. Sir Kagero will teach you how to have some real fun. Oh, please do, Kagero. Uh, please no, do. <laughs> you seem like a cool type. <laughs> I am a very strict teacher. It's probably best you bring an energy drink next time we meet. See ya. God damn, I Kagero. I want to. And right when I was beginning to think he might take things seriously, turns out he really is just a joker. I I don't think so, bro. I, I think he's trying to help you out. Hook up with Hanabi, maybe Sugumi, maybe Kasane, Kiyoka, goddammit. All right. So let's see what, what, what my boy Kagero be saying. All right. I always get like when... Wait, what? I always get like that when talking face to face, but I was pretty worried about Sugumi. I know how you feel about Sugumi. Even so, it was like I was talking to her father. What? Oh, 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 I got it. I got the content. I'm stupid. Uh, her father, huh? I like it. If I told Sugumi, though, she'd shoot me a glare so icy it would cut through me like a knife. That would be fine, though. I'm glad you understand, Yuido. See you later. Alrighty, I think that's all the bonus episodes we can do for this. Oh, no. Wait, hold up. Didn't I do the the thingy majingi with... No? Wasn't this... Okay, maybe I'm having deja vu, but I swear we did the bonus episode with this guy and we were doing some talking about his family and how he's old and he should get a partner or something or i'm missing something wait hold up hold up hold up hold up uh let's see uh characters no 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 not that not that uh bond episodes here we go gamma 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 so oh no this is a brand new one okay never mind i'm stupid i'm the stupid one all right <laughs> all right also that was one of the bots, you know, that's the second bot. Lunar, whatever it is, I had to figure how to do that out. I mean, how to figure all that out. So I'm probably going to ask Goki later on, which Goki, if you're helping me in the future, I, I want you to, I want to let you know that your support, I appreciate it, man. I appreciate your time. So I wanted to say that in this video. But anyways, that's besides the point, let's get on with the story. Let's go and do some Gamma stuff and then do Traverse. Okay. All right, Luca. All right. Did Kasane really kill Chairman Sumiragi? Could that calm and compose Kasane really commit murder to settle personal grudge? Hey, anyone can do it. Anyone. They, everyone has inner darkness inside them, one way or the other. I, I truly believe that. I truly believe that. No one Gamma, is an angel. Want to go into town with me if you're free? Is something going on? We talked about checking out trends, remember? I looked up a lot of interesting places. <laughs> oh, that. Okay. I did promise you, after all. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm sure you'll find something you like. I hope so. Damn it! I, I, I didn't I didn't hear what you say. I, I'm assuming something about shopping. <sighs> Are you all right? Sounds like Give we're in a, a little bar. Time to gather my thoughts. That was a lot to take in. I dragged him all over the place to show him the latest trends. Yeah, yeah. See. But maybe I went a little overboard. Let's see. We've checked out all the new trendy spots. Was there one that caught your interest? What was that last one? I got mobbed by a herd of giant cats inside a room. Ah, the VR Cat Cafe. Ooh. That was pretty crazy. It's apparently very popular with girls for their soothing effects. That was supposed to be soothing? Do youngsters these days find being buried in giant cats soothing? It's more like a nightmare. I can't say either. For sure, because I haven't that been one, there. We were trapped inside a tiny room and forced to do confusing puzzles. <laughs> right, the escape room. I thought that was pretty fun solving the riddles with vision. Well, I'm <clears> glad <throat> you enjoyed it, at least. Which means you didn't. Sorry, I, I mean, we're talking about there. a 50 year old no, man. I'm sorry to be complaining so much. It's not your fault. I just don't know how to enjoy them. 
I had no idea that amusement had changed so much. This is much different from the era I'm familiar with. To be honest, I can't keep up. I see. I'm sorry. Maybe we can grab something to eat to salvage the day. Oh. All right, but what to eat? I don't really eat here that often. Brother, you need to get out. They have a lot of different kinds of dishes here. What do you usually like to eat? Hmm. I'm not really very particular about my food. I guess I like gyoza if I had to choose. Gyoza? Oh, they have some interesting looking gyoza here. A new and popular dish the chef recommends. Is it some type so. of food? I don't really have a good feeling about it, but we came here to check out what's trending among the young people, after all. You don't need to force yourself. It's okay. I've made up my mind. Let's do what we came here to do. <laughs> Thank you for waiting. Here's our restaurant's special variety gyoza platter. Please use any combination of these ten sauces. Enjoy! Oh! What Who's is that this? cutie serving Green, us? Yellow, red, black. Are these supposed to be gyoza? I don't have a clue what gyoza <laughs> is. Uh, seems like these are the restaurant's original gyoza. Apparently, they all have different fillings. Ice cream, maybe? Are just as strange as their colors. I see a round one, a square one, and this one has spikes. Is this what gyozas have come to in this day and age? I can't believe how much the food I once knew has changed. You're making me mm -hmm. Google this. Oh, they look weird, but they actually taste really good. Why don't you try one? Eat this? I'm not thrilled about it. But I can't stand here and waste food. Oh, it's like All right. fish? Hmm. You're right. Oh, it's like a dumpling? This doesn't taste bad. It's not what I'm familiar with, but it's interesting. Rather interesting. I'm glad you like it. Yeah, they look weird. But you can't know until you eat them. Maybe Facts. I was too wary Facts. because they seem strange. They're pretty delicious. If you can appreciate these, that means you learned how to enjoy one of the latest food trends. <laughs> mm. Oh, man. Just because these gyozas happen to taste good doesn't mean I've learned to adapt to this age. I think your ability to appreciate them is important. That you were able to get past the way they look. You may have a point. At the end of the day, people still enjoy the same types of things. Even if those things may have changed. Just spin yeah, it around. Exactly. I may have failed choosing good spots for you today, but I had fun checking them out together. I wasn't able to enjoy the newest trends, but I did have fun walking around the city. Damn. I felt behind the times every time I experienced something new. Time may pass, but our true nature remains constant. Just that our perspectives may have changed. Hmm. That hit the spot. Thank you for the meal. You're finished eating already? You must have really liked those. This might be my new favorite food. I guess trying new things the isn't so bad. Well, let's do this again sometime. That's fine with me. But please, no more of that cat cafe. I don't dislike cats, but it's <clears> unsettling <throat> when they're that large. <laughs> uh, Are they cat girls that. or? Okay. We won't go there again. People dressed up in cats. It seems part of it was Maybe a little I misread too much that. for him. But I'm glad he ended up enjoying himself overall. Do -do 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 -do. I'm stating the obvious, but you're young. Yeah. Well, yeah. Thank you. Younger thank than you. you. I thank know you. I was young once too. I look young. I just can't really remember it. You should cherish this time while you have it. You know, I hear that a lot, and I think I should cherish the fact of my age. I will not reveal it. I mean, I have revealed it at some point, but not any time in the present. You know, in 2021, I still have not addressed it. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. I have not addressed my age, at least in this year. But I probably did, like, very, very, very long ago. I don't even know the video. <laughs> I probably said it somewhere. Uh, anyways. Uh, let's go. We got level 2 with Gamma. Increases the recovery speed of the SAS. Secret Clerokinesis. Gosh. Also, when you are attacked, there is a chance for a vision of Gamma to appear and block the attack, negating damage. Uh, that's a lot of characters. Okay. Alright. Alright. I think I'm beginning to learn who you are as a person. I feel like I've learned about you, too. Oh man. I'm just a plain old kid just wants to play some swords. Kaya, Kaya, Kaya! Okay, that's so cringy. Uh, Bond episodes? No. Bond? Where's Luca? 
Oh, now it's the homeboy. Last homeboy. But before I do that, I gotta read this. Yuido, I take back what I said. I wanna go back to that... <laughs> I wanna go back to that VR cat cafe again. The, they way... Wait. They way? Is that a typo? Is that a typo? The, the way they so openly play with my left arm wasn't too bad. I think they meant to say the way they so openly play with my left arm wasn't too bad. Typo. I will get it, clip that, and say typo on Scarlet Nexus. It's it's gonna be a thing. It's gonna be a thing. Hopefully the Bandai notices this or someone notices on the grammar. Punctuation. Got you guys. Got you. Roasting. Anyways. What? I thought that traumatized you. Of course you can. But what about your left arm? Uh, the, let's see. The clerokinesis is progressing on my left arm. It doesn't impede my movement, but I normally hide it. It's unsettling and it's dangerous if it hits anything. So even though it was digital, I couldn't believe the day would come that I could touch a living thing with this arm. I see. I understand. That's the healing effect. Not bad. Maybe I, maybe, maybe, you know what? Maybe I, I have, you know, my English is not the best. I mean, I did pass English, but it's like, my grammar is not the best. So maybe that's right, but whatever. Let's go and move on. And let's do Trevor's. Let's see. Tell me as soon as you experience any symptoms, such as memory loss or any abnormality. <laughs> oh, I can't speak English today. Or feel any abnormalities with your physical condition. Let's do the Bond episode, brother. Man, this episode is going to be full of vulgar English. But you know what? You know what? I'm going to get some water, bro. I'm going to get some water. Be right freaking back. We are back. We are here. We are back at it again. Let's blick this. Blick, blick, a blick. A list. Gleek, clock, walk. Fun episode. Yeah. I, I, we're going to go with it. Luca, can I ask you something? Yes. I will answer if I can. Oh. Is it about my brother? I don't care about your brother. Uh, you mean former Major General Karin? No, not that. I wanted to ask you about yourself. We're fighting together now, so I wanted to know more about you. Ah, uh, about me? Did I say something wrong? No, I was merely surprised. People mostly ask about my brother, so I don't usually talk about myself. I want to know more about you, Trevor. Your brother is Karin, after all. Yes, for better or worse, most people notice him. I am frequently in his shadow. Nah, don't so worry, I Luca. Assume people want to talk about him. Nah, you I a badass. Apologize. Don't worry about it. I kind of understand how you feel. My older brother isn't like former Major General Karin, but he's known for always being an elite. And I'm me, so people are always comparing us. Chief Kaito. True. He must be very capable to become chief of the OSF at such a young age. True, 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 true. It's hard having a brother that's good at everything. It makes it seem like you're bad at everything. I guess it's not like that for you. Hella I mean, mood. You're a Septentrion. The fact that you're just as good, if not better than your brother, is known among both the military and civilians. Regardless of what the military or civilians think of me, I'm no match for my brother. In a lot of ways. Screw your brother. So, you wanted to know about me. What exactly did you have in mind? Yeah, right. Uh, what, what are your are hobbies? hobbies? <laughs> this is like an old-fashioned arranged marriage. Well, my hobby is exercising. <laughs> this guy is Despite something my else. Looks, I enjoy honing my body. <clears throat> I created my own program a long time ago. And I exercise every day. Oh, wow. damn. Exercise. Where's the six pack, boy? He doesn't look like he works out. He's skinny <laughs> and small. Yeah, that's what I was Did thinking. Do you just think he doesn't look like he works out? No. What? <laughs> no, no, I didn't. <laughs> no. Please be honest. I won't be angry. <laughs> oh, god damn. Uh, yeah, I did think that. I didn't know you could read minds as well as teleport. <laughs> it was written all over your face. You're not very good at lying. Guilty. <laughs> good to know. Well, I understand why you would think that. It is very difficult for me to build muscle. 
However, by continuing, I am seeing gradual results. It is true that persistence pays off. You're a hard worker. I mean, if that's yes, what you think, that's all that matters. exercising too. The more work you put into your muscles, the more results you will see. I wish I had muscles. You I used to. Working out. From the looks of you, I think you'd see good results. Oh, I would. I if would. You follow the training program I created. You'll be ripped in six months. Uh, you want to DM huh? me that? Ripped? You know, I'll do that. Tell me if there's Trust. an area you would like to train. If you want washboard abs or shoulders like melons. <laughs> melons? <laughs> I don't want to get that big. True, true. Not uh, too big. I'll let you know later. Come to me anytime. Damn, Luca. I, you know, we're gonna get a bond, homie bond, bro. Uh, what is it? Not, not bromance. Uh, bro, what is it? What is it? We'll be homies. That's what I'm, I'll, I'll leave it at. I'll leave it at that. Uh, anyways, uh, let's see what what my boy Luca says. Ahem. <clears throat> we have been talking about my hobbies so much. I forgot to ask about yours, Yurido. Would you mind telling me? What are my hobbies? My hobbies, I like to collect baki goods and do housework, I guess. Cooking is okay, too. I, didn't ex I did not expect you to be good at cooking as well. I have actually been thinking of changing my diet to improve my muscular lately. I want to have a shredded back. Ooh, damn, Luca. Look at you, brother. Sheesh. Killing it. I would like to discuss a high-protein menu with you. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, you don't look it like... Yeah, brother. You don't look like it. You don't even look ripped. You probably shed it, but then I, I've watched a lot of manga and uh, you know, people like with these type of body types tend to be ripped too, you know, respectively. Uh, is, it, is that it? Is that all the stuff we can do? Yeah, that's it. Unfortunately. So we have a team bound level up, level one. There's nothing else I really can do. So, hmm. All right. I guess we'll just go ahead and carry on with the next stuff. But before we do that, um, let's go ahead and take care of this brain mass stuff. Yep, I had four. A couple left, uh, BP, so... Hmm. What should I hand? Should... I know before, in a previous episode, I, I don't know if I edited it, it, but I haven't edited the last stream, at least. Yeah, I've edited everything up to the point of the last stream from this one. Uh, which is, like, the fifth session. And I remember one of those sessions, I, I think I cut it out, that I had this one. But now I don't have it. So you know what? Let's have it. Let's have it. Screw it. Let's add it on. Let's go. So that's it. We have no more BP. And let's go ahead and investigate. Because there's nothing else there is to do. Uh, if there is. And if the, I mean, if there's not, I'll probably make a cut right here. Alrighty. So I guess there's not really much left to do, to be honest. I've been thinking about this too much. My brain is going numb. I should get some rest. I'm about to get some rest soon. Yes. Yuito, wake up. Watch your on the line. Huh? What? Sorry. I only meant to take a little break, but it looks like I fell asleep. So, Wataru. What's up? Is the fact that we snuck into the old OSF hospital going to be an issue? No. Major General Fubuki was able to take care of that for us. So that's not a problem anymore. It might not be a big deal, but... I thought I should let you know about the hole in Kunad Highway. Now that you mention it, there was something strange in the sky above Kunad Highway. I guess you could call it a hole. So much happened after that, I'd forgotten about it. So what was it? The government is calling it the Kunad Gate. A that little wormhole? A look, but aside from the extremely localized gravitational anomaly, <clears throat> I don't know anything about it. It's just that it has similar characteristics to a black hole. So that area has been deemed off limits. Kunad Gate. Nothing could be seen on the other side. It was unsettling. You might not go there, but I figured it's better to know about it than not. Facts. That's true. Thanks for telling me about it. If you learn anything more, please let me know. As you wish. Oh, I almost forgot. Yuito Platoon's next orders are to stay on standby. So you can hang around the hideout a little while longer. Really? Then I think we should do just that. Yes, oh, we're gonna that go on more dates. Idea. Knowing Fubuki, I'm sure he arranged all of this. So I think it's best to comply. 
So, choice to face it. Eyes open. All right, phase is six. Mind if I come in? Fabuki, my man. Major General Fabuki, how did you find this place? I told him. I thought it would be safer to talk here in the hideout rather than meet in the safe zone every time. Thank you, Luca. I managed to sneak past their surveillance, so we should be fine for a little while. They started monitoring you? I told you before that I was a government dog, but I don't have to be a dog anymore now that Karin's gone. What do you mean? Karin's <laughs> personality didn't make him popular with the government. The top brass has been targeting him for elimination or personality rehabilitation for some time now. That's why I took on the role of being the government's puppet, directing the OSF in Karin's place. So, does he... He doesn't know that I had to become his monitor in order to protect him from the government. Ah, you the Besides, homie. even if I told him, he'd probably just tell me to stay out of it. To be honest, I'm a little relieved. I don't have to be the government's yes-man anymore. Government surveillance will be stretched thin after Ceron's uprising. I don't plan on missing this opportunity. I should be able to bring change to this country by taking a different path from Karin. Hey. Different path? What are you planning on doing? This country is aggressively pursuing power research through illegal human experimentations. I have no idea why. They can get away with it because the government has complete control over information. Even the media is under the government's monitoring and influence. I want to find out why they would do this and free this country from its corrupt system. Karin joined forces with Ceyron and rebelled against the state to do the same. However, I feel that collapsing the government system from the inside is the fastest way to results. My brother is trying to change this country from the outside, while you're trying to change it from within. Yes. Feigning loyalty allows us opportunities to learn valuable information. We should be able to find out what the government is hiding through the city computer Arahabaki. Please, let me help you. Did you say that? I want to know what my father has done and what my brother is hiding. Yuito, you are the commander of this platoon, and a commander's number one responsibility is to their platoon members. If you attempt to pursue these government secrets, it will undoubtedly put your platoon members in danger. Are you fully aware of that? Then please, remove me from command. I can't do that because, for better or worse, there are many eyes on you. There's also the fact that your post was specifically ordered by Chief Kaito Sumeragi. My brother. Well. If we all agree with what Commander Yuito is doing, then it doesn't matter. <laughs> Either way, my, my time with the OSF is drawing to an end. I'm getting too old. Hmm. But before I leave, I want to uncover the truth. I want to know why that my happened boy. to Naomi. And why Nagi received personality <clears throat> rehabilitation. I agree with Gemma. If you're going to try to uncover the government's secrets, then I would like to help. I was also subjected to this country's human experiments. What do you mean? My brother Karin and I received power enhancement treatments. Oh. I had no idea. If Yuito can't be removed from the platoon, then you can remove the platoon members instead. Any member who doesn't want to take part in this can simply be assigned to a different platoon. Fine. I can't very well turn down your help now. However, reorganizing your platoon requires paperwork. So I will issue you an official deployment order in the meantime. Please gather intel around the Seiron area. I've heard OSF deserters are appearing around Mizuhagawa. Former OSF members sympathetic to Seiron's cause could be up to something. While you're investigating, I will take the steps necessary to reassign Hanabi and Sugumi to a different platoon. What? Oh. Okay, get to it then. Oh, so baby girls don't, don't want to hop in? They didn't say anything. You could have contributed. Yuito, I'll stay in the platoon as the operator. I feel the same as you and Gemma. I'll help you stop the government from doing whatever they want. Thanks, Wataru. Yo, Hanabi. Do you, you could have said, you know, you want to... Would helping Major General Fubuki mean that we're making enemies of our families and people we're trusted? Ah, oh, I see you. Yes, it is. And I'm willing to do that for my own family. Let's go. Wait. Workout? Oh, Travers, my boy, bringing out that... Ooh, bro. Benching like 40... 
45s on each. Nah, but that's probably weak, huh? That's probably weak stuff, huh? I'll probably, I can't even do more than two plates. I probably I could. Let's see. What about you, Sugumi? Something tragic happened to someone close to you, Yuito. That's why it's only natural that you want to find out the truth. Yeah, yeah. So y'all want to get reassigned. All right. I see what's up. All right. Do, 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 do. Uh, do, 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 do. Let's go in. Let's go to the Misogawa district. Construction site. Doom, doom, do, 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 do